Um, good evening, Council and Mayor. Um, tonight we're looking for approval of a five-year lease agreement. It's a renewal with Laytalk County for the management and operations of the uh, Phillips Farm Park. It's located just north of Moscow, 160-acre uh, parkland. And uh, the present uh, lease uh, expires at the end of this month. The new lease, it's a five-year lease, expire in uh, October or September of uh, 2022. Um, along with this uh, would be an annual uh, maintenance cost share of $5,000 a year. And, uh, and that's something we presently do now as well. Um, with that, um, this was reviewed by the city attorney, the contract. And uh, this also was brought before the Parks and Recreation Commission who uh, recommended approval. Um, last week we brought this before the Administrative Committee who recommended approval. Um, these last years where Laytow County has been managing this park and the system, we've had no issues. I mean, they're really easy to work with. Uh, they keep us informed, bring us in when needed. Um, they're doing a good job out there, and quite frankly, they've done some things out there that we probably couldn't have done, you know, if we had been uh, managing that. Um, and uh, if you didn't already know, uh, we have our second restroom in a year, and one of them is at this park. So... Um, um, with that, um, we would ask uh, for your approval of this lease. Okay, this was an administrative committee on the 28th. It was. Together, so. Yeah, we had a good discussion. I was just looking at my notes. We ended up talking about the dogs. Remember the, because mm -hmm. there were question people wanting more, like thinking about a dog park, and we you ended up getting, giving some information about how people are using their dogs and controlling it and the county looking over it. Do you remember? Would you kind of talk about that again? Sure. Um, well, I mean, the contract, the lease agreement actually says that they must be leashed at all times. And just like uh, most of our parks, it's always an issue, and especially that far out. Uh, they don't have a permanent residence there or a permanent presence, so um, it's even more likely that people are not going to have their dogs on leashes. Um, so Andy's been looking at that. Uh, for years he's been looking at this. Uh, Andy Grant, uh, their Parks and Recreation Director. And um, they have no plans other than to just keep working on it. Um, they have looked at or thought about possibly an off-leash area, bringing a proposal for that uh, based on what we're already doing. Um, I mean, if you can't beat them, you know, join them kind of a thing, uh, but have a designated area. Um, but they've not, they've not put that to paper yet. They're just, they're just looking at ideas. Walter, you had a question? Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. Um, Dwight, something I saw this evening, and I apologize. The leasee on this is Lake Hall County. Yes. That's in the first paragraph. And then down in the document, um, paragraph 8, or section 8, calls for the plan to follow Exhibit A for a forest management plan? Yes. Okay. And if we go to Exhibit A, which was written in 1995. It's old. It still seems to be pertinent. The leasee is listed as Better Living Incorporated. Mm. <laughs> well, I good catch. I wonder if we should not make a change in that. We could do that. Um, I guess we could. I guess that's a legal question. Rod, Maybe. you want to address that? That lessee is the, actually the county's in their stead now in that agreement. They've taken that their spot in, under the forest plan. It's whoever we're leasing it to is bound by that, and that's the would be the county. But this list, Loretta Stallbrand, Genesee. Yes, they were the predecessors before. I know that. I understand that. But okay. but that's no longer the lessee. N no, but the forest management plan, we're not going to go manage or amend that contract or that management plan. It's addressed to how to manage it. And the Laytaw County is to abide by this management plan. So there's in the stead of the original lessee. We're still the lessor. I and understand. The lessee I understand, but I'm not sure why we would list a lessee from 22 years ago if that's no longer the case, and particularly a phone number and address. Mr. Mayor, Gary had, has a comment. Gary. Yeah, Exhibit A is the management plan that was uh, 
came into place when Better Living Inc. and Loretta Stauber were leasing that property from the city. The management plan has not changed. Agreed. The management plan is the management plan. So we would either republish the management plan or make it an exhibit to the new contract, which is what we did in our previous contracts with Latah County. Understand the confusion, but the management plan itself pertains to the property and is less than, or Rod indicated, that Latah County steps into uh, Better Living Inc.'s uh, position in that management plan. And one other thing, uh, Tom Lamar's name is misspelled on the signature line. I think I'm right about that one. <laughs> we got that from the county. I don't. I don't think he's changed his name to that. Yeah, spell. I don't think so either. We'll, we'll, we'll correct that. That'll be easy to fix. With that, uh, Gina. Your Honor, I uh, move that we approve a five-year lease agreement with Latah County for the management of Phillips Farm Park as a county park. Effective October 1, 2017, with an annual maintenance cost share of $5,000 and the edit to Mr. Lamar's name. Mm -hmm. Seconded. Okay, we got a motion by Gina, a second by R, to approve the five year lease agreement with Latah County for the management of Phillips Farm Park as a county park, effective October 1, 2017, with an annual maintenance cost of share of $5,000 annually, plus a Tom Lamar correcting <laughs> on his spelling. I'll take the roll, starting with John. Aye. 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 And aye. Okay. Thank 